Mission Racing um, is a team that was formed two years ago um, by myself, Russell Owen, and my partner, Nicola, Nicola Ratcliffe. Um, we both worked in the, in, in, in the racing trade, we'll call it, for a, for a few years. Um, we started off doing a bit of hospitality, actually, as it started, but we got to know um, some more teams and riders as we went. And uh, a rider that used to race for a team set his own team up. Um, a good six or seven years ago, an Australian rider, Dean Thomas, um, and eventually he went back to Australia, and uh, I decided to uh, give it a go myself, try and pick up where we left off. My name's Jordan Gilbert, and I'm riding for Mission Racing in uh, Stock 600 2017. So it's Yamaha R6, fairly old bike, 2010 now, doing the job at the moment. I had a few bits done to it at the start of the season, went for a refresh, found out that it wouldn't be able to be refreshed, we put a stock engine in there now, so it should be good to go. So qualifying went well yesterday, I ended up fourth, I wanted to be front row, but yeah, we'll take it. I mean, fourth is good outside of the track, down the hill, should get a good run into the first corner. And the race is going to be a scrap. Top five, six are going to be flat out, you know, scrapping it out, harsh moves. Uh, it's going to be tight. Hopefully we get a, get a podium is what I've been working for. So yeah, that's the ultimate goal. As they surge into the first turn, Tom Oliver then grabs the advantage. Oliver leads it from Stamper, Brad Jones in third, uh, Tom Neve in fourth, Jordan Gilbert, Aaron Clark. He's cut underneath Tom Oliver, through to fourth place goes Jordan Gilbert. If you're confident with it, you can just let go of the brake and let it go in. Like, Rather uh, like Brad Jordan Jones Gilbert did then. <laughs> yeah. It's victory here at Brands Hatch for Dan Stamper. Second place goes to Brad Jones. Third place, Jordan Gilbert looks pleased with that. Just over the moon, I proper glassy eye when he got in that in that uh, in that pit box. You know, just couldn't believe it. So, yeah, I mean, all the hard work, the team. You know, it's just paid off. My hard work, you know, the, the training and stuff like that. Um, people don't know how much hard work goes into this, and I just yeah can, can't believe I've got this podium. First, first ever. So hopefully the first of many. Russell does a great job with the the budget he's got. Um, you know to run such a, a professional team uh, he does a great job and then um, you know Chrissy is uh, he's he's not got a great deal of experience on the thousand so um, trying to give him all the all, as I say, all the little pieces to the jigsaw in, in terms of setup, chassis, geometry, and, and stuff. But it's, to be fair to him, his feedback has been really good. Uh, after each session, when we come in, we do our debriefs. Um, so it makes it easy for me to, to know what we need to do for the bike for the next session. And same with Jordan, you know, Jordan's same. He's a young lad. Um, they've both got a good bit of grit and determination and all the will in the world to, to push on and do, and, you know, do what they're capable of doing but there comes a point where the bike uh, limits what they can do until they make changes so uh, hopefully the pieces of the jigsaw that we're putting in place is giving them helping towards give them the results that they need. Hi my name is Chrissy Rouse I'm from Newcastle upon Tyne and I'm racing for the mission racing team. Yeah so over the weekend we had qualifying and then we've actually had our first race already qualified in eighth position uh, got a good start straight up into the top four five managed to get up to third place in on lap 17 just made a couple of mistakes and the race got red flag uh, 10 laps from the end and I finished up in sixth position which means I start today's race in sixth I would like to definitely be in the top six but a good result for us would be I think fourth that's what I'm aiming for A huge grid. There's going to be a lot of lapping going on. A brilliant start from the middle of the grid by Danny Buchan, number 83. Yeah. At the front, Cooper, Buchan, uh, Rispoli, Rutter, Rouse. Oh, what a move. Chrissy Rouse then. <laughs> Chrissy Rouse then on the Aprilia, but he has to drift wide and the Aprilia tries to go up the inside. The two young guns attacking one another up Mike Haywood Hill and it's Chrissy Rouse who hangs on as they go round the right hand at, at Druids. Oh, and hang on, there's a hand in the air there from number 12. Uh, and is it, that I think we might have a red flag out. We have got a red flag out. Oh, and hang on, there's a hand in the air there from number 12. Uh, and is it, that I think we might have a red flag out. We have got a red flag out. Yeah, reasonably happy. Uh, finished that race in seventh. Um, I was wanting a podium or top four, but yeah, did the best I could today. Uh, I thought it was a very tough race. Uh, I was sort of on the on the back of the pack, and I got quite a harsh move, which pushed us wide, and that sort of dropped us off. And then from then, I just struggled, um, struggled to make up the time. 